Why well, hello there, welcome back to my channel. It is of course Chelsea of She Designs Things. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you website builders that I like that are not Google Sites. So of course, if you'd like to know more, then stay tuned. So the first website builder I want to share with you guys is called Cargo. So if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I have created a site called The Marquee that is actually based on a cargo template. The cargo template in question is actually Wireframe D393. And so here is just a look at what it looks like. And I really like the simplistic look of it. I liked how when you click on the pages, this is exactly what it looks like. So I literally decided that I wanted to have the same aesthetic, but inside of a Google site. So the Google site one, it obviously is a little bit different because it is a Google site. It's not as expansive as cargos are, but, but. Cargo gives you the ability to create these sites that are really cool and basically whatever you want. Um, I know within Google Sites, we have our limitations. You are set to the width. Like you can only um, edit the site from like here to here, which is something like 900, I don't know, something like 900 pixels per inch, something, something like that. But inside of Cargo, it's built similar to Squarespace where you can go from side to side, as you can see, like even looking here, um, this is way over here and this is way over here, which we don't have the option of doing that inside of Google Sites. So we're kind of limited and a way to work around that in Google Sites is to do a custom homepage if you prefer, which is what I do. I will always opt to do a custom homepage over paying monthly service fees. But if I had to choose a site where I had to put a monthly service fee, then Cargo would definitely be one of them. Now, the use cases in Cargo, they span a whole genre of things that you could possibly do. But I do find that Cargo works especially well for those of you who have portfolios or are working inside of the art um sphere now one thing i will say <laughs> when you're looking at some of the use cases they're a little bit out there but i think that is the appeal of cargo it allows you to think outside of the box and to design or create something that you just that's aesthetically you and it doesn't feel as though you've created something that's similar to anyone else so Definitely check out Cargo if you are interested in having a website that is something, again, that is 100% you and your style. So here is a great example. I'm just going to select this one because, well, I actually said my name. <laughs> I didn't even notice that till now. Uh, but here we go. This is kind of a Cargo design. And as you can see, when you hover over the work section, it changes what it says, it changes it to hello. And so that is actually really cool. And then it looks like little, like, I guess like a little, um, a custom uh, cursor that they have put in, which you can do inside of Cargo. And let's see, let's see, I'm gonna click on this one, the bones, the bones of dance. And this looks like a brief. So as you can see, it definitely is a brief. <laughs> um, so this is more like a student portfolio that we're taking a look at here, but it's really cool. So if you are interested, again, a link will be left down below for Cargo. The next website builder that I absolutely enjoy working with is called ReadyMag. ReadyMag was definitely designed for designers. Um, it's a similar style to cargo in the sense that it, you know, you have this like limitless width when it comes to the grid. And that's what I love about a lot of these other website uh, builders is you can r create some really fascinating design. So here's a great one, like a really good example. Um, I just really enjoy how groovy the font is. It actually reminds me very much of my latest Google site, which is the groovy one. Um, and 
I've never seen this one till now, but it's definitely, it definitely gives me the same vibes. Um, and I just really enjoy Ready Mag. Now here's another example of something that you can do inside of Ready Mag that you can't do in other website builders that I have worked with. So what's really cool is this one, it gives you kind of like a little bit of instructions. Um, you free the page from these elements by hovering over them. So I'm just going to hover over and kind of delete the distractions from the page. And that's essentially how this will work is you hover over it, you delete the uh, distractions. And what also is really cool is as you scroll down, it gives you like some more um, things that you can do that you you can't even tell like so these i can't hover over them now i must click out of them and that is just so cool like just look at it this is really awesome um and this isn't something that you have like inside of your most website builders yet alone a google site so i really enjoy um whenever i have to have a design that's inside of a ready mag side note i will make a video here shortly one of these days when I get around to it. Um, kind of going over all of the website builders that I have worked with as, as, as far as like the platforms, some of my favorites and then some that I don't really like. I know that I make Google Site videos, but to Google Site isn't the only one, only website builder that I work in. And it's also not the only free one out there. So I do want to like, expand again this channel is she designs things so i do design a lot more than just websites just so you know <laughs> um but i also just want to share with you guys some of the other options out there because for a lot of my clients google sites work but there are a number of cases where it will not work so <clears throat> for the ones that it won't work for i try to recommend other solutions such as ready mag or cargo the next website builder I'm going to talk about is Universe. Now, I like Universe because it is unique in the sense that it is designed for you to design mobily. So not only are we putting mobile first, we are designing on a mobile device. I actually use Universe to share my um, links. So it is my personal brand link in bio, uh, which is aesthetically dope. But say, for example, you um, want to have a full website, you actually do have the ability to create a full website using <laughs> Universe. Now, this is what my link in bio site looks like for my personal brand. Um, so this will lead you to a, a number of places. I have my blog for my aesthetically dope, which is aestheticallydope.com. Literally, if you Googled aesthetically dope, I I'm like the only thing that comes up. Um, the link to buy me a coffee, you can actually email me, view my gum road, and you can get my free anger management digital planner. She designs things in the bouquet lens, which are my two businesses. What's also really cool about Universe is that you can have an e commerce store. So whenever you click the link to buy me a coffee, you can actually send me a little bit of, you know, support for this channel. I am not monetized. I'm close. There are 900 something of you and I need to have a thousand of you. And I'm like a little bit more than halfway to where I need to be to have the hours requirement to be able to monetize my content. But for now, I just deal with, I may cash the regular regular way, which is hard work. <laughs> And the YouTube videos are extremely hard work too, but I have received a lot of clients through YouTube. So definitely check out on Universe. Um, it is specific, I think, to the Apple Universe, but again, they do have the ability now to develop on a like a web application using your your browser. And just so you can take a look at some of the sites that have been designed outside of mine, here are some of the really awesome sites that have been created using on universe and i just love the the off the cuff it's definitely in line with my personal brand aesthetically dope which if you you know obviously if you were to view my aesthetically dope this is exactly what you would see um it's it's 
just really cool so if you like that gritty style that you know pop art vibrant um punk rock everything in between i want to say urban just anything that's not like clean lines and elegant like if you like that you could definitely do something inside of here but i do find that it definitely looks the best for those of us who have a little bit more color and um like vibrant retro styles <laughs> The fourth and final web design that I want to share with you guys, or website builder I should say, is actually Adobe Spark Pages. So if you've never heard of Adobe Spark Pages, I had never heard of them myself until I was playing around in the Adobe Express on my iPad and then I saw that they had Adobe Spark Pages app. And then when you read it, it's design web pages on your mobile device. So not only can you design it on your iPad, you can also design it on your desktop. So I am a Windows user for my desktop. I have a Windows PC. And so I just threw this page together really quickly just to share with you what you can create inside of the Adobe Spark. And this was really cool. I have this split design here. So the image is on one side and then some text on the other side and then that scrolling effect because that magazine style layout is extremely popular and I do like the way that this looks. Then we have a button, so I just added a button in here. And then in the center part, we have this, you know, bit of text I decided to use um, cupcake lore mipsum in order for me to get this information in here you can have youtube videos and then again i really love this sort of scrolling um parallax effect that you can have so i'm going to scroll back up a little bit and then just look at the quote that comes up um on this bottom left hand side of the screen because it pops up and that is just phenomenal to me and something like this you can easily create inside of your web browser or you can go ahead and create it in your phone if you want it to because it's super easy to do um, so i'm going to just exit that i'm not using a theme i'm just going to share with you just quickly what it looks like so i have my hello friends a random site for random people and then i just sort of added this information in here by um in the panel whenever you want to add something you click the plus signs and then you can have a photo text button video photo grid and then a glide show or um like a split layout so just so we're clear this over here is a split layout i can reverse the split and this down here is a glide show. And a glide show is where you have an image in the background and then on the side, you have this box where you can have text, you can have a button, a video, and another photo. So definitely, if you have never used it, if you've never heard of it, definitely check out Spark Pages. It is free and included with your Adobe account. So if you're someone who's like, I'm trying to save coins, but I really don't want to get started or use um, like Google, <laughs> Google sites, I got your back. <laughs> All right, so that is it for the website builders. Please let me know if this is something that you guys like or you're interested in, or if you want to see an example of um, any of these website builders that I've shown in the video, like if you'd like a tutorial, like a full tutorial on how to get started or how to use them, just go ahead and leave a comment down below and let me know and I will try to get to making that video for you. And also when you comment, just, you know, kind of put an idea of like a site, <laughs> you know, like an industry, like I don't know, design a bakery website in, well, ready mag or <laughs> whatever the case may be. Just make sure you leave a comment down below so that I know that it's something you would like to see. All right, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had a happy new year, of course. And I look forward to sharing uh, my 
new sites with you guys and additional content this year so as always thanks so much for watching and laters